Welcome to the wonderful world of the Tuscan Riviera, Forte dei Marmi. It's hot, beautiful, and expensive. Always a favorite destination for actors, footballers, and show business personalities, Forte dei Marmi is one of the most exclusive resorts in Tuscany. It is located in Versilia, in the province of Lucca, not far from the border with the province of Massa Carrara. It is on its kilometer-long golden beach that it is possible to meet VIPs of all kinds and backgrounds, just as it is here that photographers gather in search of the perfect gossip for the front pages of the tabloids. The Hotel Bijou in Forte dei Marmi, in the heart of Versilia, in the quiet of Forte dei Marmi, is the ideal place to spend relaxing and unforgettable holidays. If you have decided that Forte dei Marmi will be the destination of your next summer holiday, you should know that you will have to raise your budget a little. Everything is expensive here, from the rental of beach umbrellas and sunbeds, which goes up to 100 euro per day, to the drinks at the bar. Not to mention hotels and parking. But if you can afford it, leave now. You will find one of the most intriguing destinations in Italy waiting for you. If, on the other hand, you cannot, Keep in mind that Forte dei Marmi is an hour's drive from Florence, half an hour from Pisa, and only 20 minutes from Viareggio. Don't miss it. You might regret it.
Carolina. Luzca. The Church of Santa Hermite is the main place of worship of the Catholic religion in Forte de Marmi in Versilia, seat of the parish of the same name belonging to the Archdiocese of Pisa. The structure was built at the expense of the local inhabitants, inaugurated on the occasion of the marriage between Roberto Raffaetta and Luisa Cesarali. Located in the center of Forte de Marmi, Lorraine Fort is also known as the Fort. Lorraine Fort was built for defensive and siting purposes along the northern coast in the 18th century. Lorraine Fort takes you back in time to the 18th century with its architecture. The fort has also served as a marble warehouse during the period when Forte de Marmi was a seaport. Lorraine Fort is now home to the Museum of Satire and Caricature with a huge collection of material relevant to the history of satire and caricature. A short walk from the hotel, you will encounter the coolest soul of the city. Elegant and iconic, the city center is full of luxury boutiques and trendy venues. Here, every stroll becomes an opportunity to discover the latest trends or enjoy an aperitif in one of the many exclusive lounge bars. No, di mano il tutto. Ma scritto ora, io non sapevo mia. Pesce baracca, da This summer, Pesce Terrazza, the renowned rooftop terrace of Pesce Baraka, with breathtaking views of the horizon and the Apuan Alps, and the exclusive food and beverage selection by, respectively, chef Stefano Pizzini and director Fabio Bianchi, is signed Veuve Clicquot, the famous Maison de Champagne with a unique and distinctive heritage an iconic takeover that transforms Pesce Terrazza into a sun club, the exclusive collection of pop-up terraces located in dream destinations around the world where you can fully enjoy the Veuve Clicquot experience. Starting from late afternoon, the terrace comes alive for the aperitif and from the kitchen, always open until late at night, Exquisite fish dishes continue to emerge to be shared at the center of the table and to be enjoyed among unique sunsets or in the moonlight in a cosmopolitan, lively and sophisticated atmosphere.
The pier of Forte de Marmi is undoubtedly one of the symbols of the city, offering a unique panorama, reaching the end of the bridge, as the inhabitants of Forte de Marmi affectionately call it. You will feel immersed in the blue of the Tyrrhenian Sea, and turning back, you will find yourself under the protection of the embrace of the Apuan Alps. We, the inhabitants of Forte de Marmi, without the pier, lose the horizon, Fabio Genovese, writer. The evening atmosphere of the brightly lit city center is complemented by a comfortable air temperature that replaces the daytime heat, and you don't want to return to the hotel at all. Shop at the boutiques and stores in the pedestrian center of Forte de Marmi. You'll find well-known Italian designers. There are also more budget options, like Intimissimi Benetton, Woolrich, and Subdued. Local artisans compete for your shopping euros with their beautiful sandals, handmade shoes, and boots. Even if you don't find something to purchase, it's a fun town to window shop in. It's pedestrian friendly, so you don't need to worry about traffic. In Forte de Marmi, you will always find all the latest in high fashion. All boutiques are open from 10 a.m. to 9 p.m., with a short break in the middle of the day. During the peak tourist season, some shops are open until midnight.
Returning to the hotel after a day at the beach, cycling and shopping is always a pleasure, especially if you have a glass of wine on the hotel terrace and relax in your room. Piazza Garibaldi, the beating heart of history and tradition in Forte dei Marmi, is the custodian of testimonies that date back to distant times. Among its most precious gems stands the well, the pride of the square since 1842, the year in which it was placed with the specific mission of supplying departing ships and watering the working animals that with majestic effort, pulled carts, carriages, and stagecoaches 
loaded with goods and lives to be transported. This ancient well, still unchanged in its original position, is a symbol of resilience and connection between the past and the present. Imagine the images of sailors and carters who drew fresh water from this well, preparing for their exploits at sea or on land. The history of Forte de Marmi is carved into the contours of this square, where every stone tells a story of toil, but also of hope and progress.
Unfortunately, Forte de Marmi does not have a promenade with a sea view. A bicycle and pedestrian path runs along the beaches, but the sea view is blocked by low-rise buildings of restaurants and beach houses.